Good morning, uh, Dennis Ledford with Cobalt Banker First Realtors. I'm here this morning with Steve Moss, Executive Director for uh, our Blue, Blue, Mount, Blue, Mountain Action Council. Blue Mountain Action Council. I've known Steve, I don't know how long, and he's been instrumental in helping our community with some of the needs that uh, some of the families just need help in. And Peter is our chairman with the Realtor Association for Carriage Chair and the Food Drive. Thanks, Dennis. Steve, good to see you. Um, we had a good year. Uh, it wasn't one of our best years, but that's okay. We had a great year. Uh, one of the things that we really established this year was the second year now that we've involved the school district, the Walwell School District. Next year, we're going to try to get involved with the college place in Wakesburg School District. So um, they did a tremendous job. The elementary schools did fabulous. They had a 55% increase over last year collected. So when we have gains like that, we know that we're reaching the people that we need to reach, and that's the young people to instill in them how important it is to give to people that need it. Peter, uh, what was your actual weight totals? If you a little remember? over 30,000 pounds this year. Uh, so we were down from last year. Uh, some areas were way up, some areas were down, but uh, that was a little, almost 30, about 32,000 pounds, I think, total. And then with the cash donations and also with donations like from our office, that will typically, it's, you know, for every $10 you can buy about $30 or $25 worth of Steve, product. Steve, uh, how big a piece is the food drive and the dollars raised for this? to the community and Blue Mountain Action. Yeah, Dennis and Peter, thank you for having me here this morning. The, 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 the Realtors Association over the last 25 years yes, really has been involved in, in giving back to the community, um, spending time, energy, um, making connections available uh, to, to meet the needs. The Realtors is the number one uh, group as far as uh, collective giving to the food banks. Our, our role in the community, we have a, a warehouse, we collect, sort, and distribute the food to the food pantries or the smaller food banks in the community, there are four of them, that meet uh, the, the large need. It's, it's grown over the last couple of years. Walla Walla has, has changed as far as our demographics, uh, the economy, we've been hit as the rest of the country has. But it, it's the community coming together meet the needs, and, and that's so very important. Um, understanding what our needs are and then meeting those needs, and that's where the realtors really have, has stepped up. I'd like to thank Peter for all the work he does. I know well, he's uh, uh, the man with the passion and sir, drives the realtors. It is a passion, but it takes all of us. All but but you're really good at embarrassing them to get yeah, the I work do. done. I do. I try. I try So hard. we like that. <laughs> uh, and Cobalt Banker uh, collects a small donation on each closing that we do within our office and we pick a nonprofit to donate to every year and it's my pleasure this year to tell Steve that we've again agreed to give our funds that we've collected through the year to the food drive and uh, it this our is, staff that is all staff yep, driven, all staff driven. Uh, <laughs> I helped a little bit but uh, You'll be getting a check, Steve, for three thousand two hundred fifty dollars. Oh my gosh, that's fantastic! And uh, three to one—that's almost ten thousand dollars. Yep, was going to say yeah. eight to ten thousand dollars of food. That should be a big help. Yeah, especially that's going into the holidays. Yeah, that's so. fantastic. Yeah. and I know the the real estate market has not been the best. Uh, you guys are out there working hard every day mm -hmm. to uh, match buyers with sellers. Sure. And again, strengthen the community, and this is, this is very much appreciated. 